Last year, Google introduced a new feature for Hangouts on the web, allowing Google Apps customers to share links to Hangouts video calls so that external meeting guests may request to join if not explicitly invited. Google has completed that rollout across all platforms earlier in the year. Starting today, Google has made this feature even more useful by removing the requirement that guests have a Google account in order to join a Hangouts video call. Here's how it works. Guests without a Google account who have been provided with the video call link by the organizer will be asked to provide their name and then request to join the call. So let's go ahead and demonstrate this. I've created a Hangout for myself and it's just going to be this Hangout example. It's at a Yahoo account. So I'm just going to go ahead and open up that Hangout. We'll go into that meeting. I'm just going to go ahead and mute myself as well as turn off my camera here just to limit any feedback that we may have. I'm going to click on join. Now I'm going to jump over to my other screen and I'm going to go ahead and invite myself. That was from another account. So we're going to go ahead and request to join. And you'll see here it's saying that this person outside of my organization is trying to join this call. I can either decline or accept. If I go ahead and click on accept, it now says that this person can now join that call. And there it is, the person from outside of the domain. So that's one of those nice features that you're going to be able to utilize when it comes to asking people outside of your domain to be able to join the call. You'll have that opportunity as the organizer to either accept or delete. So just another new feature that Google has thrown out there in terms of usefulness in your Google Hangouts platform.